is going to be why I meditate, what is meditation, and five reasons you should start meditating today. So what is meditation? Well, there can actually be different types of meditation, but today I just want to focus on a general broad sense of what meditation is. It's just shutting off the loudness of the mind. So I want you to ask yourself, when was the last time I took a second to just breathe and feel gratitude for that? When was the last time you thanked your body? for doing everything it does for you. When it comes to meditation, there are so many reasons I do it, I don't even know where to begin. The number one thing I can say is mindset. I'm gonna start there. Mindset is everything. Your thoughts are everything. Your thoughts create your reality. Whatever you're thinking is gonna be what you're feeling. At all times, you have control of your thoughts so you always have control over how you're feeling at all times. Meditation helps you become aware of that and become in control of your thoughts. Meditation helps you choose the thoughts that you want to be having. If you are not in control of your thoughts, your thoughts are going to be in control of you. And if your thoughts are in control of you, who knows what could happen, good or bad. Your thoughts do not always have your best interest in mind, but your higher self does. And when you meditate, you're able to connect with that higher self, that higher consciousness, and you're able to consciously then make the choices you want to be making. <laughs> Meditation does so much. So if I could put that into a sentence or a number one. The first reason would be mindset, mental clarity, and mental well-being. Before meditation, I wasn't really even aware of my own mental well-being and my mindset and how much that impacted my everyday life and my everyday, every moment's actions and behaviors. Meditation helped me find that, helped me find my power, helped me take my power back. The power that I thought I had given up, the power was always in my court. But meditation helped me reclaim that power. I hope that makes sense. If it's not making sense, in due time, it will. And my little hand tie just fell. <laughs> so that's why I look like this now. We're just gonna rock with it, okay? Number two, the second reason why I meditate, not the second reason, but another reason that I'm calling it number two, because all of these are number one from the wise words of Tim Grover. Everything is number one. Everything is equally important. Number two is it helps with total body health. Ta-da! Total body health. Meditation just so happens to be one of the most powerful tools for total body health, meaning mind, your emotional health, spiritual health, mental health, physical health, all the above. They're all important. They're all equally important and they all must be addressed. Okay. What's really important to me is that it helps regulate my blood pressure, helps regulate my metabolism, helps regulate my stress levels, helps regulate my hormones. All of those are all interconnected and very important for healthy functions within the body. And meditation, quieting the mind, calming the body, calming the nervous system, letting the nervous system know it's safe. Just powerful things for the body, that mind-body connection. Oh my gosh. I'm just learning so much every day about this and I'm so excited to share it with you. Personally, I've always dealt with a lot of anxiety and tension and stress and really high cortisol levels. Meditating helps me manage that without medication. I choose to medicate naturally with food, nutrition, health, well-being, and meditation is just one of those tools of natural medicine. Just Google right now meditation success stories for blood pressure, anxiety, anything. Meditation helps with total body, total health, because you're not just the body. Which brings me to number three, meditation has helped me with weight loss. Weight loss is ultimately just a result of your body being in balance, total body health balance. So kind of goes right along with 
the one before, but I've recently lost 30 pounds and meditation has absolutely been a key factor in me losing that weight and keeping it off. And that's why in my program, my Total Body Transformation Coaching Program, I have weekly meditations, if not more, for my clients because it is that crucial to your transformation, in my opinion. Within meditation, I use creative visualization and visualizing my ideal body, my ideal health. Visualize what I want for my life, what I want for my body, what I want for my health, and then bring that into reality, that mind-body connection again. And it also helps me just want to be healthier and eat healthier and move my body and do the self-care and the self-love things. So really, it helps me love myself more and remember who I am and remember my purpose in this world and what I'm meant to do here, which brings me to would be number four, manifesting my dream reality, my dream life. Like I said at the beginning, thoughts become things. Or I didn't say that, but I meant to. Thoughts become things. Your thoughts create your reality. So meditating helps me connect with my inner being and in doing so, it helps me become who I really am here to be and who I want to be. If I'm trying to be somebody, grow myself, it's ultimately because I'm meant to do that. I believe everything happens for a reason. Life happens for you, not to you. Life happens for you, for you to be able to learn the lessons you need to learn to put you where you're meant to be. For you to be able to learn and grow and do and embody the person you're meant to become and be in this world. So meditation is so powerful. It helps me elevate my consciousness and get into higher level thinking. Even when I'm meditating, I can put myself in other energetic dimensions. Essentially, meditating helps me be a better person and it helps me make this world a better place and that only has positive ripple effects. And lastly, meditation has helped me find such a deep inner peace, joy, and love, and happiness, and bliss, such excitement for life that I didn't have before. Meditating gives me such a calming, relaxing mood. It really can put me in whatever mood I want to because it's quieting down the mind. It's focusing and being present, conscious, in the moment, aware helps me set intentions for what I want to achieve. And I love doing guided meditations because it helps you stay focused on a certain intention at that time. And that's what are in my coaching program are guided meditations based around health, weight loss, nutrition, mindset, body positivity, self-love, to name a few. I can really say my life has definitely changed for the better now that I have a habit of meditation in my life. The best time to meditate is gonna be in the morning, right when you wake up when your brain is primed and in the perfect state. Second best time would be right before bed. But any time of day is a great time to meditate and give yourself some love and care and just breathe. So just take a moment with me. Just take a big deep breath. In through the nose and out through the mouth and just be the observer. And just keep breathing for a moment and just notice the breath, notice how it feels in the body. And just relax into that. And smile. And know that at all times you have that peace within you, that calmness within you. And you always deserve a moment of peace. So I hope you've learned something new today about meditation, and I hope you are excited to start meditating, changing your life for the better in all areas. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with somebody. Comment below any questions or takeaways. If you'd like more information on meditation and how to get started, I have a free meditation guide with two guided meditations and affirmations, another tool I use. I'll leave it down below. And then also check out this video. It's a free guided meditation for gratitude. It's gonna help you feel so much better about your life and bring you so much more peace and happiness into your life. So give that a listen too. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time.